This is a demonstration on how to use the AquaTabs test kit for testing the chlorine demand of water. The test kit consists of AquaTabs tablets, 3.5 mg strength, and chlorine test strips. The first thing you have to do is measure out a litre of test water sample. This water sample would be from the source that you intend to treat with the Medentec product, either Aquatabs or Aquacept. Fill the samples to the one litre mark. Having filled the samples, you can now add the Aquatabs water treatment tablets. Next we'll add the Aquatabs tablets to the samples and start the reaction. Tablets are in strips and can be torn off. In this case we will put one tablet in here, which is sample one, and we will put two tablets in here, sample two and start the timer. If you look in the picture you can see that the tablets are starting to effervesce and they will gradually dissolve and the chlorine will react with whatever there is in the water. Now as the time approaches four minutes, the AquaTabs tablets have completely dissolved in the water and now the chlorine will react with whatever organic materials are in the water. We will leave it now until the hour mark and then we'll test it for the concentration of chlorine residual. After one hour test using the taurine test strips. Test strips have the colour indicator on the side. Open the tub and remove a test strip. Now, now we're up to about one hour. So we'll test the first sample first, which was the one with one tablet. Put in the tablet the strip for five seconds. One second, two second, three second, four second, five second. And now compare the colour on the guide. We can see the colour on the guide is coming in at about 0.3 chlorine on this strip. Now we will test the one with two tablets, much the same way. Take out the strip, put it in the water, go one second, two second, three second, four second, five second, and we can check it against the water. So you can see it's much stronger colour coming up to around between 2 and 5. Now because the first strip had 0.3 within it, there was enough chlorine. If you had tested the test strip and not seen any chlorine, then you would know you would have to use a higher dose. So for instance, if we look at the water which hasn't been treated, One second, two second, three second, four second, five second. Now if we can compare this on the test strip you can see that there is no chlorine. The reading is zero. So if you do get no colour like that or anything less than the colour of 0.3 you know that the dose isn't high enough and you should use a slightly higher dose. If there is a very high dose in the water you may need to add three tablets or four tablets. The two tablets, one tablet which is uh, the 3.5 milligram corresponds to two parts per million of chlorine. The two tablets corresponds to four parts per million of chlorine. And so long as you have a dose 
of 0.3 in the water, 0.3 in the water after one hour, you know that the dose is high enough.